Oh, we're live. Yeah. As yeah. I move my chair. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> How's it better than that? How does it get better than that? <laughs> Mr. John Ashford, how the hell are you, buddy? Oh, uh, bro, I'm doing pretty good, Paul. It's good, yeah. it's good seeing you this morning. Yeah, uh, good to see you too. I'm excited. I'm yes. excited, yeah. Yes. So, what are we talking about, Paul? Well, we're talking about Symphony Group Taster Sessions because we did one last month and it was friggin' awesome, off yeah. the charts, brilliant. It was pumping. It was really, really cool. Yeah. It's 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 one of my favorite things. And and one of the what I'm finally learning now, what I finally learned in the process of doing SOP is yeah. being that energy in yeah. everything. Yeah. But doing the symphony taster sessions for me, it's like having dessert before your meal. Yeah. <laughs> so for me, it's it's that exciting and it's it's an energy. And, and I try to explain to people what that energy is. And I, I've given that up because it's, I say to people, you have to, imagination. There is a movie in the States called Willy Walker Chocolate Factory. And mm -hmm. Gene yeah. Wilder was the actor in it in the 70s. Yeah. And it was a song called Imagination. And he mm -hmm. sang this song. And to me, that's what the energy of SLP is. It's all those things that you've hidden years ago back in the closet that if you open up your imagination, they can come forward. And you can actually really start to really fucking really live. It's yeah. an energy about being present, about expansiveness. And when we did that last month, it was a small group, yeah. but it was so freaking expansive to me. Yeah, and it was so powerful. And it's it's exactly that. It's the power, like it's imagination. If there's no limits, so it's like no limits. What can we choose? What can we create? What else is possible? And it's. Um, yeah, it's a joyful, beautiful, spacious energy. And it's like, if we drop our barriers and receive it, what's truly possible for us? Like, I, I get the whole world is changing and it's intense for some people, but mm -hmm. it's like, well, for lots of people. But also, what if we engage and embrace that that intensity and we just go for it? It's like, what yeah. else is possible here? Yeah. You know, I, I, I always use this word, you know, I played sports here in the States and they always talk about make something your bitch. What have you made intensity your bitch? And SOP was the horse you got to ride on. Yeah. You know, that's how I look at I, I look at it. It's just like, you know, there's something very revealing within those sessions to, to you if you're willing yeah. to receive it. Yeah. Um, it's something that's extremely revealing. It's something that opens up. And I keep on and and I, I struggle with words with this. And this is what bugs me about it. It's just like, you know. But if you watch it or you see it, it's very mysterious. It's this, it's this thing. It's like this dance. It's like, it's like something that you want to date. For me, like if you had somebody that you admired and you wanted to date and you saw them, you sat back and you were watching them from a distance. SOP is, is that luring energy that flirts with you, that just allows the body to be able to do and be things that it never fucking imagined. Yeah. And, and, and also it's, um, it's undefined. So you don't, it's not like one session is going to give you this one session is going to right. give you this. It's like every session is so different. And that's what I, I loved about it about the last session we just dived into and it was just beautiful. It just opened up such a space and such yeah. a potency and such, um, an ease. And it was just like, wow, this is pumping stuff. Really, really pumping. Yeah. And, 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 and I hate, I'm, hey, I'm not, I hate to say this. There also is a, in this term, this world's term, a healing a a aspect of it, of like, you feel lighter usually after a session. Yeah. It invites you to a space. It, 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 it's almost a space that I would call a familiar. It's like I knew of, it's like I know of this from someplace else. Yeah. You know? And for me, uh, it's so much fun. I mean, yeah. what would it take for people to invite themselves to that space? You know, uh, and this is just a taster. This is a simple taster. We're doing it four times. Yeah, which is awesome. Friday. Yeah. Uh, you'll get to experience the magic of uh, Paul and I. And uh, what would it take for you to 
gift yourself gift yourself with this especially like you said in these these times right now i think people have this pressure this unseen pressure and sop has a capacity of expanding outside of that pressure so you can choose something different you can see something different yeah yeah totally and it also just everything is possible it's literally a symphony of possibilities so when we say group go um group symphony taster sessions it's like that's the symphony of possibilities so it's like everything is available everything is open and it just depends on what you ask for it's like yeah. what can you ask for now what can you receive and as you open that space more and more stuff starts coming in and it's dependent on your a willingness and your ability to receive so what can you receive today that you never thought possible how yeah. many times you thought that's impossible that's impossible that's impossible oh no it's not and it's like yeah. okay cool let's go achieve it yeah yeah yeah, I like that. I like what you said. It changes the impossible to possible. Yeah, Just totally. Within seconds, and it's yeah. Not, and and uh, Maureen was saying that the, the, it went it went way beyond anything she's ever experienced before. Mm. I have to say, as a practitioner facilitator of that, every time I have that experience of doing an SOP session, my reality, this reality, gets smaller. And my body gets to expand way, way beyond whatever I thought I could ever imagine. So I, I, I like it because it allows me to live in the space of impossibilities. Yes. Yeah. It allows me to play in that space where before I had this, I, I you know something, Paul, the thing about it, I want to say to people, check this out. Before, when I first saw Dane doing an ESB, it took me back to when I was a kid. And I know this is kind of crazy. There was a movie in the States called Star Wars. Everybody saw it. And yeah. it, it was this guy by the name of Darth Vader. And Darth he, Vader. Darth Vader, yes. Yeah. And he was able to yield energy and use energy. And I remember it was a COP. I think it was in Charleston. Dane was in the back of the room. Uh, Gary was doing the class. And when I walked in, I went to the restroom, I walked back and it was this energy that pulled me like it was like and I was like, whoa, you know, and I was like, what is that? And I had a session there and I was like, oh, this is a familiar. This is something that I've been searching for for a long fucking time. Yeah. And it has gifted me with all types of possibilities now. But and I don't want to say the and and I I I'm not gonna put a title or words to what it has gift me because it's an energy. Yeah. And you it's impossible to harness energy. You might try all day. And so SOP allows you just to be connected with everything at one time. Like bam, like it's like a sonic boom going off in your body connected yeah. to the universe. Yeah, you're super sonic stoked about this one. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And it is, it's amazing. And sometimes when you change one energy, everything else starts to change. And you're like, wow, I've been choosing this for years. I thought this was mine. None of this was mine. And then you start to acknowledge, wow, I've got a different choice here. I can live a different life. Yeah. Yeah. That. That's mm. what it is. And what happens is that, and this is another piece, and I, and I was sharing this with somebody earlier. I was on a another program earlier and I was, and they were talking about being stuck. If you feel that you're stuck in any energy at all, what I've come to find for myself is that SOP simply possibly cry or get in between and actually slowly lift you off to space that you can actually jump to something different. Mm -hmm. And and I know that sounds weird. And I know people are like, well, what does that really mean? What it, that what that creates is this space that I can choose anything immediately. Yeah. And for some people, that's the first time I mean, I've done sessions for some people. They're like, what the hell was that? It was just it's a space. Yeah. A fucking space that you could actually. And once you get it, once you once you have that space, you want to come back. Yeah. <laughs> there's, no, there's, no, there's nobody taking it off yet. Nobody taking yeah. it off. Yeah 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 i mean it's 
it's allowing the beauty of you to show up. And it's like so often we think we have to look like this, have to do this, have to have this person in our life, blah, 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 blah. And what if you just allow the beauty of your being to arrive? So you got the body and the being. And it's like, what if you just allow that to arrive at the beach where you are? And it's like, what's possible? Like, what's truly possible? Anything can be changed. Yeah. That. That. I, you know, I, uh, yesterday I got a bars exchange. I did a bar exchange with somebody uh, here in Portland, in Camas, Washington. Yeah. And uh, she was feeling that she was stuck with something. And uh, I said, well, can we just do this little taster of this SOP? I was like, because I was telling her about our class. I said, you might yeah. want to check out Friday. I said, well, let me just give you a taste of what this is. And I was sitting there and it wasn't much. And I was doing the SOP session with her. And she just said, wow. And she said, mm -hmm. What was that? And I was like, I'm not going to even attempt to put words to it because your body, I could see the person's body and their body was just like melting down and it was expanding. Yeah. And yeah. Uh, I'm not going to be shocked when she signs up for this because I think that once you invite your body to that space, mm. you actually become like Superman or Superwoman that you know that you can conquer anything. There's nothing that shows up that's impossible for you. It's nothing yeah. but possible you know yeah and it's letting go of the wrongness and actually dropping your barriers and allowing you receive all the things that you perceive are problems it's like yeah. what's the possibility underneath this what's the true possibility i'm not looking at here and what do i need to change as gary says you got to be gary douglas the founder of access conscious says you got to be willing to change on a dime so it's like every every five seconds okay cool what am i choosing now what am i choosing now what am i choosing now yeah you know, and the, and where else could you find something like that in this mm. reality? You can't. Yeah. I mean, really and truthfully, it invites you to that space. And once you get to that space, you realize, oh, I'm never stuck because yeah. every 10 seconds I can choose something different. Mm, totally. Totally. Yeah. And also it's like how many magical people can go on the journey with you? It's like start to acknowledge us not just you. You're not alone. There's lots of other beings. There's lots of other people. There's lots of other um entities that want to contribute to you and allow yourself to receive them yeah and and the other piece about you said something about entities it's just like uh, i know this might be weird to some people first time if you've not heard this before and you're new to this some people maybe are like what is this but this thing you talk about entities i have this thing that i do every day i do entity uh, uh sessions or uh i have a team meetings with my entities and one of the things that I started work, working on with this SOP energy is being present SOP energy with the entities. And it actually creates a different wow. space that I never used yeah. before. And I was just like, I didn't realize until recently that it actually has expanded my capacity with entities. Yeah. And, and it, 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 yeah, as you do more classes, your consciousness expands more anyway and sometimes you feel like you've gone backwards but you're actually just aware of of the energy that's been unleashed for somebody else's world yeah. so it's like what's truly possible for you yeah so what would it take for people to come show up yeah totally what would it take loads and it's like it's starting on friday so uh this coming friday and um it's going to be four 30 minute sessions i'm excited yeah. we can cover any topic you want but we're definitely going to be including body we're going to be including rest we're going to be including relaxation going to be including uh tips on meditation so there's there's a lot there there's a lot there yeah so come play come have some fun yeah give to, totally. give to, give your body with something special <laughs> how can you turn down that invite that smiling little yeah. face that yeah. little smiling <laughs> face yeah you don't want to miss this you don't want to miss this yeah and that, that's what i was shocked at the depth of the last one because we kind of got started and it was like whoa yes and it was like holy guacamole yeah. it was so yeah. strong so good and it's like what can we create now truly what's possible yeah yeah that's definitely what i've been experiencing with it it was just like i'm excited and i i i, I this time i'm looking so forward to this because I realized after the first session that we did that we opened up something yeah and I'm really curious to see where what we would change on the planet yeah and that's the other piece that I think that with with uh, the sympathy of possibilities it actually makes changes upon the earth yeah it's like 
it's like planting a seed. SOP sessions to me is planting a seed in the earth and it takes mm. and it creates a fruit of whatever is desired. So what would it take for people to tap into some farming on Friday and change? Yeah, have some fun. That sounds yeah. pretty freaking yeah. awesome. It's like what else yeah. is possible? And it's like if if you haven't experienced SOP energy, come along to experience it. If you have, you know what it's like, but it's like it's getting deeper and deeper, more and more powerful. Every class is totally different. And me and John, our styles are quite different as well. So yeah. it's like, yeah, what else is possible? What else? Yeah. What else? What else? What else? Come play. Yeah. Cool. Awesome. So, Thank you guys. Yes. Hope to see you guys Friday. Looking forward to seeing some beautiful faces. And what else is possible now? See you guys on Friday. Peace. Bye-bye, guys.